got to teleport to your sword. Um, sure. <laughs> it's stupid. Yeah. All right, let's go shopping. Hey everyone, my name's Carlos, and this is Kingdoms, where all your nerdy dreams come true. And today, this is Commander Melee. This is season two, episode four of Commander Melee, where we play high power commander whilst trying to keep the jank alive, trying to keep it EDH still. And uh, yeah, before we jump into the game, just one big announcement. You probably have heard it a few times already, but I want you to go over to www.mtgsummit.com. Uh, we have a huge convention going on. We want everybody from around the world to come. We have amazing guests. We have awesome events. Our pre-release weekend is for the Brothers War pre-release. We're going to give away an unlimited Black Lotus to the winner. Among tons of other prizes, Brandon Sanderson is revealing his vintage cube with a bunch of new art and a bunch of fun stuff going on. So uh, yeah, super excited. It's a big ordeal. We'd love for your support, even if you just share this with your friends, um, but we'd hopefully like to see you there. Um, check out all of the different socials for a lot of our special guests. They have some special um, discount codes for you to get a little bit of money off of your, uh, your ticket. Um, but yeah, with that, we're going to uh, talk a little bit about our commanders. Hi, I'm Jason R. I'm playing Mindara, Merciless Soul. We're playing token tribal and sacrifice theme and flicker theme. So we're just going to rack up experience and then beat people over the head. Hey everyone, it's Jordan. Um, I'm playing Ragavan today. Uh, this deck is a little bit special. I have to give a shout out to Jaden B. He's one of our Patreons. Um, he asked for some advice on this deck. I met up with him, gave him some advice and stuff. We built the deck together and then he gave it for, to me to play for it tonight. So I'm really excited to see how it goes. Jaden, hopefully we win. Hey everybody, uh, I'm John. Uh, I'm playing Emrakul, The Promised End. Um, we are playing a 13-drop commander next to Ragavan. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the goal is to just ramp as hard and as quickly as possible and uh, hopefully get to cast my commander, take other people's turns from them, and uh, play their decks better than they do. Something special I'm doing for my deck this time, this is a little bit of a modular deck. It's Counterspell Tribal which I'm sure my uh, friends here are excited about. <gasps> but uh, I roll, I'm roll. i going to roll at the beginning of the game to see which of these three will be my commander. See what we got. One. All right. Baral, Aww. Chief of Compliance. <laughs> uh, the Baral lines are trying to you know make sure to always have the right cards in hand. As you counter a spell, you can draw and discard a card. So there's pros and cons for each one. Uh, but thankfully, I can block uh, Ragavan. Pips. No, you didn't! Oh, yeah. Look at this, though! Look at this! That's oh. so cool! <laughs> so close! Wow! I have a pregame action. Son of a gun! Gemstone Cavern, exiling big score. Gross. Draw for turn. Let's play Concealed Courtyard untapped, and then pass turn. Alright, I untap, upkeep, draw. Cast Ragavan, Mountain, and Sensei's the Binding Top, and pass. Okay. <laughs> Mm -hmm. All right, let's go uh, Eldrazi Temple and cast a Mana Vault. Oh, man, oh, no. And cast a Basalt Monolith and <laughs> pass the turn. Draw <laughs> card. Island Pass. <laughs> this is great. Please play Force Spike. Do you have Force Spike? We are going to cast Wall of Omens. Oh, that's a blocker. A uh, card and pass. All right, untap. Upkeep. Draw. Braggy Man will go ahead and hit Mr. Ramp over there. Uh, No blocks. All right, take two. Commander damage. And give me the treasure of an exiled card. I'll cast, uh, I get my treasure token, and then I'll cast myself a sword of hearth and home. And pass. Untap, and I will pay to untap mana vault. So I'm surprised you didn't. Okay, I will play a wasteland and pass. Draw a card, play another island, play a Baral Chief of Compliance. Begins. And so it begins. Well, I need counter spells. Draw for turn. Let's play a snow covered plains. I think I need to do this. We're gonna cast Monologue Tax. What do? <sighs> Whenever an opponent casts their second spell each turn, I create a treasure. 
box. That's yeah. so cool. I knew you'd need a treasure, that's why. Yes. <laughs> and pass. Untap. Uh, Adventure's Fair, I have three treasures. I'll, or three artifacts, I'll gain a life. Yes. Passing. <laughs> Land for turn. I will cast an early Dockside Extortionist. So just three total. Yep. So I currently have four treasures. I'll go two to equip Ragavan here. Pro white, full green. Close. We will attack you. Okay. Take yeah. two. Take two. I will get a treasure and exile the top card, and then I have this trigger right you here. You take four. Savine's yeah, Reclamation. Return target permanent with family value three or less from your graveyard to the battlefield. Exile forever! It's gone forever. I will go get myself a mountain untapped, and then I will blink my own dockside and get three more treasures. This is gross. I, I don't think so. I think this is great. <laughs> um, and then with six treasures, I will sacrifice them and play Ancient Copper Dragon. I create a treasure. Uh, I'll pass the turn. <laughs> Nope. Drop. All right. So let us go for a Hedron Archive and cast a Oblivion Stone. Uh oh. Ooh. And that's the turn. There you go. This is so, so bad you for me. Second spell, right? Yeah, I got two spells. Okay. But Try you know. Untap. Uh huh. Drop. I guess I won't play what I was gonna play. <laughs> I'll pass turn. So that's the show that's all on my permanence. That is, that is yep. text. Without, what's it called? Comic. Fate counters. Okay, <laughs> draw for turn. Play of planes. I'm going to sack the treasure for black. Three others. We're just going to cast Mindara. Um, move to end step. A uh, treasure left my battlefield, so I get one. It's just Spirit any permanence. Treasures are so good with Mindara. That's so cool. Um, when it comes to me, I will activate Sensei of Vining Top. Like, in your end step, yep. I mean. Priority. I'll leave it like that. Go to untap, draw my card. Gaining life. Mono red decks do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I will have the dragon go at Carlos. Mr. Ragavan will come at you. Uh, what about the guy blowing you stuff, all your stuff up? I haven't touched you yet. No just blocks. a little tickle. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit tickle. So no blocks on either of you. Any effects? No effects. I got triggers. All right. With the honors. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, that's all really right. sad. I'll get two treasures. From the dragon, so I'll go up to four, and then five because of Ragavan. Let's see that top card. Uh, Flying Vigilance, Snowlands, and the Battlefield Tap. Not creature spells. Your opponent's cast costs four mana to cast. Or Snowlands cost two men. Inner tapped. Yeah. Shut him down. <laughs> oh, and then I also blink Ragavan. Dog said. It's one, two, three, so six. six. Since these are going to go away, we'll use four of them. Sacrifice this. We'll go find an artifact. I think we'll just get Commander Flight. Super effective. This is one of the cards Jaden really, really enjoyed, so good call. All right, I'll spin the top, see if anything changes. All right, we will activate top. I will actually put top, top on top, and then I will use one treasure, tap three lands, and I'll cast Anger. For those wondering why I'm casting Anger now, it's so when it dies, it will give all my creatures haste. So I can cast Ragavan for cheap, go down to three treasures, and I'll cast Redine. Cool. And that'll be my turn. Uh, make a treasure. I'll take a damage, because my mana vault is tapped. Let's go with a Heap Gate, and I will pass the turn. Mm, draw a card. Play land. <laughs> pass the turn. <laughs> <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Untap. Draw for turn. Jordan, hmm. snow-covered swamp. <laughs> Sucker! That's amazing. Yep. <laughs> so stupid. I'm just gonna crack a treasure and end my turn. Untap. Draw a random card. Go to combat. When are you, when are you gonna pop it? That's for me to know and you to yeah. find out. I'll still have this come at Jason. I'll have Ancient Copper Dragon come at you. Uh, Redine, Anger... We'll come at... Send the flyer at me. Yeah, I'll still send the flyer at you. So I'll just have the Ancient Copper Dragon come back at you, and then Redine. Um, do, doing the thing? Kaboom. There's no point in me sacking the treasures, trying to save them because the mana would go away. That is correct. Or all you were worthless. <laughs> Not worthless. He blocked. You should he cast him and block. No, he himself. blocked theoretical he did attacks. He block and mental attacks, yeah. All right, I will pay three, cast Ragavan. He does have haste. And then I will cast three. Sensei's Divining Top. I will pass the turn. Look at this horrible board. Mobilize district. <laughs> I saw these gates. <laughs> That's not a gate. It should it be a gate. Just, I'm playing every gate I can. Oh. It's technically possible for Baldur's Gate to be plus one mana. Dang. Yeah. Huh. And uh, I'll pass the turn. End of turn. I, I sacrifice guess this, this for Archmage's yeah. Charm. I'm going to choose gain control of target non-line permanent with mana value one or less. You don't want a top? 
No. <laughs> so rude. That's, that's my entire deck. Well, okay. <laughs> oh, uh, what a monster. Yeah. You did some real damage to me. I'll draw for turn. I dealt you six damage. That's a lot. Don't come after me. I will remove it. Jordan, let's take number two. <laughs> yeah, I'll take two. Okay. Keep the treasure. treasure, please. I'll cast a thought vessel. Mm -hmm. Kill the blue player. Yeah. <laughs> Always kill the blue player. Jeez. Make it stop. <laughs> Jeez. As people are rebuilding, I think I'll throw out a Rhystic Study. <sighs> Pass the turn. End of your turn, Carlos. We're going to cast Oblation on Rhystic Study, and I will pay the one. Nice. So you get to draw two cards off of your Rhystic Study. Well, that's that. yeah. that's <laughs> into that. I think that's kind of a good deal for everybody. Yeah. You draw um, two. I will draw two. Um, I am at seven cards. Undone. Doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. Stop yeah. Vessel. Whoa. <laughs> draw for turn. We're going to cast an Arcane Signet. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to try to cast Elspeth, Knight Errant. Nice. Response. It's all good. Yep. So pick her up to five. Make a dude. Make a soldier. Pass the turn. I'll untap. Cast Chandra. Nice. I will down tick and kill Ragavan. Uh, end of turn. End of your turn. I'll shimmer. Uh, drop. <gasps> what? A Gond Gate. Ooh. Oh, nice. the gates. Yeah. Shimmer is coming at Chandra. Yep. I will oh. pass the turn. Draw for turn. Play an island. I mean, I might just... Uh, Pay two for a Felwar Stone. I'll pass wow. the turn. Draw for turn. Okay, we're going to plus one on Elspeth and get a second soldier. Mm -hmm. What's the ult on that one? Everything's indestructible forever. Artifacts, creatures, enchantments on that side so control. Yeah. Cool. We're going to cast Bantu's Monument. Nice. When so I cast a creature, each opponent loses a life and I gain a life. A creature. And then we're going to cast Suture Priest, which is a creature. So y'all lose a life and I gain a life. Creature, creature. Is that going to combo something? It can. And then I'm going to send one of these soldiers at Carlos as a 1-1. One -one. And pass turn. Untap. Keep. Draw. Underworld Breach. So, so there's combo. five artifacts and enchantments out there, so I would be able to cast. So there's six. And then two Carlos more. is three. Yeah. yeah, I'll dream fracture that one. So You get to draw a card. Yeah, we both draw. Oh, well, Soul Ring. I'll use Soul Ring, cast Commander's Plate, and then the one floating and the red for Goblin Engineer. You lose a life. I will lose one life. Go get a piece of scrap, throw it in your yard. Yeah, and then I can pay something to bring it back out. So it has to cost three or less. The thing you entomb can cost anything. It's just you can only return mana value three or less. Um, I guess I'll blindly uh, flip top, try to hit a land. Damage I did not hit right a land. Fast the turn. In your turn, I'll tap heap gate and another gate to create a treasure. Mm -hmm. Hi, Bryce. Play a high market for, and I am going to power up mobilize district. And I will swing district and shimmer. It's a 3-3. Three, three. Oh, so it has vigilance. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 3-3 yeah, three, three with vigilance and a 2-2. Two, two. And how much is it? Five? Five total. We will just take it. Cool. Awesome. Hester. On tap. Draw something relevant. That, yeah. That's your draw. I, I, I tried. Cast this. Any counter spells? Yeah! I wonder, I wonder why he chose the counter spell deck at the last minute. Yeah, go ahead. Draw, draw, draw your card. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'll draw seven. Because it's equal to your hand plus one. Do you have a Triska deck of bottom? <laughs> I thought about it. I and really want to draw a Wheel of Fortune off the top. <laughs> She's going to counter it. I've got a plan. Did, yeah. <laughs> oh, I thought I didn't draw a land for a second. I'll if, pass. Carlos, if you win again, untap. Draw for turn. We'll play a Shambling Vent tapped. We'll make another soldier. Gain a life. So we're going to cast Gale Powder Mage. So what is yep. that? You guys are going to lose a life and I'll gain a life. That one's cool because you can exile any creature. So, flying, when it attacks, exile another creature, return it at the end of the beginning of the next sunset. That is pretty cool. And then I gain another life. Uh, let's hit Carlos for two. Boop, boop. And then pass the turn. I'm to draw since it's the winning top. Five. I'd like to try and cast Ragavan again. Sure. I will, I guess, come at Carlos. Okay. I took the damage. I'm flipping the card. Um, I will get treasure. Uh, I will pass the turn. I will gate up another treasure. Draw for turn. Uh, cast a Kozilek. Holy <laughs> cow. <laughs> Butcher of Truth. Uh, so draw four. When I uncast, 
Uh, cast trigger. Cast trigger. Responses to causal luck. Um, you don't have haste, right? Or I do, I do not have haste. I might not even attack you ever. <sighs> um, I won't do anything. Okay, great. Causal okay. resolves. Yeah. Yes, you can hit me for two. Yeah, you're thirty-seven. Take two. All right. Good. Hold you. That's a card. Play a island or an island even. Let's pay three, four, five for a gilded lotus. Nice. Yeah. Play Baral, Chief of Compliance. Yeah, to Chief. Mm. And I'll pass oh. turn. I don't really have anything. Why you know Red Blast? Because I was trying to be <laughs> respectful and not, you know, metagame and stuff. Oh, okay, great. We're going to path to exile on Coastal Duck. All right, that's fine. Do you have wastes? I sure do. Oh, you got a waste. You got five of them. Wow. I don't know. Oh, you lost a life, Carlos. Sorry. Well, I didn't, but I will. Yeah. Did you lose a life from Kozlek? I sure did. Okay, draw for turn. Let's go ahead and try to cast my commander. All his stuff is going to be getting plus three plus O. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so on cast, you I guys lose you guys. a life and I You're listening. Up. He enters the battlefield. She enters, and then I will gain a life. Going to make another soldier. Okay, no. so we're going to go one at each of you. So these are three ones. Mm -hmm. And then six more at... Carlos. So sorry, each right. one is three damage. So these soldiers plus three. are plus two plus zero. So they're all three ones. I think on attack trigger you also choose a target for that. Correct. So I'm gonna target my suture priest. Okay. This will resolve. Exiled. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Kind of turn. Wait, before damage. So I'm gonna pongify your commander. She has ward two. Yeah. <laughs> Any response? No response. Blocks. So I get an ape. You have three, three green ape. Yeah. I'll block the one one. I'll take uh, it. I'll block three, the one three. one as well. So hold down to one of these and one untapped. End of turn. Really casual magic means no interaction. <laughs> Not uh, anything else. That will come in. I will use Goblin Engineer. I will sacrifice the treasure and I'll bring back the sword. Untap. Why, why are you be threatening again? <laughs> and then you go and. Did you take the three flying then, Carlos? Nope. I could hit him for free. Because you were paying to equip? Yeah, so, yeah, that's why I did with the soldier. So I will come at you. It'll be six commander damage. Oh, I sort of ramp. Love sort of ramp. Silver key. Okay, so your ramp. Um, I'll go ahead and blink Goblin Engineer. I think I'll put Lizard Blades in the graveyard. Oh, and I also get my basic land. That's what I really wanted. Good commander on plate onto nice. Mr. Regiman. And I think this will just be exiled. When that enters the battlefield, you lose life. Oh, thank you. That's really sad. I love this card. Stop exiling my stuff, guys. All right, my turn. We are going to untap. We are going to draw. Yeah. Let's go with the Sanctum of Ugin. Oh, baby. Whenever yeah. I cast a colorless spell, mana value seven or greater, I can sack it to search my library for a colorless creature. Gotcha. Let's go with a Thought Not Seer. You lose a life. That doesn't work. So when it airs the battlefield, target opponent reveals his or her hand. And I can choose an online card from it and exile that card. Forever? And when, forever. And when it leaves the battlefield, target opponent draws a card. Are you going to target me? Target opponent? It's going to count. It's going to target you. Yeah, play a <laughs> okay. He's got busted stuff, guys! <laughs> I did it! All right. Uh, I'll draw and discard. Yeah. Discard a chalice. Uh, I'll pass the turn. Untap. Draw a card. For, for an Otherworld Atlas, which is a combo piece with... Uh, of Mind Scepter? of Matter? Mind over Matter. Or mind over Matter? Yep. Because that will make you draw your entire hand. Your drive. That will make all of us draw our decks. I think I have to pass. Okay. Untap. Draw for turn. Plus so, one. Uh, We're going to give this plus three, plus three in flying. Attack Carlos for four. Plus three is seven. Plus three on the ground. So these two are flying. So I'll attack Carlos for ten. Yeah. You called it. Yep. Doing the thing? I will activate top in response. I'm going to play and crack an expedition map. To hand. Search for any... Yeah, any land to hand. I can use the treasure to okay. cast it. Yeah, fair enough. And then pay two. Goodbye, ape. Can I try to cast Bantu's Monument again? We'll put out Elspeth again. Sure. We're gonna plus one her and make a token and pass. Untap. Draw. I will go to cast Ragavan. Uh, we'll do Soul Ring. Exotic Orchard for my land for turn. It's a very hostile to Ragavan board right now. Yeah, it really is. Commander's Plate. There you go. Go to a Oh, sorry. Commander's Plate. Uh, I'm going to offer you can't refuse. I get two treasures. I'm going to draw and discard. All right, we will go for a uh, Sword of Hearth and Home. 
Giant Desertion, what did you dispatch? Desertion. This is great. I don't worry about any of right. this protection from nonsense. Go mm -hmm. ahead and equip Ragavan. Um, he does have haste. Yeah, we'll come at you, um, Jason. For four? For four. So you get the treasure? Yep. And then I'll have triggers. Oh. So, yeah. Yeah, so I'll get the exile first. Okay. Dang it. Go look for a land. I will choose not to blink my Ragavan. So much going on with combat damage over there. I, it's a fun deck. It yeah. really has been... I decided I'm not ret rolling anymore with this deck. <laughs> <laughs> it's just I have no way of winning. Outside of like One, two, my three. huge come out, you know, my huge uh, uh, goblin engineer combo. Gotta go get Nether Hall. Uh, that will be my turn. Make a treasure with my heap gate. <laughs> Draw. Oh, baby. Uh, all right, I'll cast Ivogan. So it's two less now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Gross. Cheap Emmer call. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is gonna sound stupid. I think I'm gonna pass the turn. I'll end a turn. I'm putting a counter. Sure. Like this. Draw for turn. I'll cast pass. a spell. Draw a card. And I cast Inspiring Overseer. Love that card. You guys all lose a life and I gain a life. <laughs> gain a I'm life and draw a card. <laughs> Over time. You're desperately chasing resources. Scanning through books <laughs> for the, the answer. <laughs> I know, my chief of compliance is here. one. I know the, the rules here somewhere. So two soldiers. Getting treasure. Gale Potter Mage. Fine. Doing the things. No, Response. Mm-mm. Um, I passed priority. Well, I also have a Bontus trigger. And pass. GPM. Okay, end of your turn. I will sack a treasure to activate this to sacrifice this other treasure. And I will get Ooh. back. I think Lizard Blades. Untap. Draw. Cavern of Souls for my land for turn. I will name Pirate. And I will cast Academy Manufacturer. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I'll forbid it. No buyback. Just, just straight up counter? Yeah, it's a counter spell. I'll draw uh, and discard. See, this is an absolute win. I'll discard a temple bell. I'll float two mana. Sacrifice soul ring. Get back uh, manufacturer. Yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, with the two floating, I will equip lizard blades to sword. Go to combat and have at thee. Okay, can't block. First instance and then I'll go search. I'll go get a land and I will blink goblin engineer. I will go and put Sword of Feast and Famine in the graveyard. This will all happen before second strike damage happens. Second strike. Second strike, yep. But you, Regular right. strike. I like Where, second strike. I'll sacrifice the food, tap Goblin Engineer, and I will bring back my Soul Ring. Go to normal damage. You got Hercules? Yeah. And then uh, hit Hercules that. Hercules Recall? So Just plays card? them again. Uh, not the token. Another treasure. Two treasures, one food. Ragavan's stupid. That's my takeaway. <laughs> <laughs> Great deck, Jaden. <laughs> Jaden, this deck is awesome. Don't let anyone tell you differently. I'm a threat. <laughs> <laughs> That's called foreshadowing, boys and girls. Me? Yeah. Oh, no, that was called being facetious. <laughs> we'll see. Mind stone I'll put in the graveyard? You doing much stuff? I'll play a top for right now. Yeah, we'll just call that good. I'll just try and draw some cards at the end of the turn. End of your turn. Shimmer. And activate Ivugan. Colorless creature. Come on, Ulamog. Seven or more. But Whimsy. Any colorless creature. Any colorless mm -hmm. creature. Yeah, like. So. Ulamog? Oh, no. But. This is just exile. Oh, yeah, sorry. That's just exile. I did not cast him. Okay. There's a search. I'm at 20. Untap. Oh, thank you. I'm not planning on hitting you unless something dire happens. All right. Maybe. Reliquary Tower. Uh, Ulamog. Cast trigger target. Um, so there's some. There's. I'm also gonna do the Sanctum of Ugin cast trigger and go get a colorless creature card. Um, but go get so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. And I will so I'll sack Sanctum of Ugin, and then my targets are going to be food token. I I'm gonna do sword and engineer. Alright. I will sacrifice the sword. Yep. I think you're right. I think I do have to get back the plate. Sanctum of Ugin. I'm gonna. I sacrifice. I'm gonna search. Are there responses to Ulamog? Ulamog on the stack. I'm gonna pay five mana and Aether Snatch it. Oh. Right. What do? Gain, Gain control of target spell. You may choose new targets for it. So the cast trigger's already happened. It's on the stack. So yeah, you gain control. So of it's just when it resolves, it will be under your control. Mm -hmm. But you, the, none of the other stuff. 
That's still really scary. And it's his turn next. Yeah. He's probably going to block. Like, how much money left? That's probably true. <laughs> I don't care about your grave, your libraries. And I'll pass. I mean, Let's all draw a card. Sure. Quite a bit. Draw for turn. Oh, I drew a land finally. Woo-hoo. But I just drew this card. <laughs> for six uh, Boo! Boo! Came back to me, baby! Queen of Slime! <laughs> Filth! Uh, Puge yeah. Trashants! <laughs> it doesn't mean nothing right now, but it makes me feel really good. <laughs> oh, I heard Milan. I'm gonna pay oh, no, four a, for a Jace yeah. Wielder of Mysteries. Oh, there's a win. Piece. That's a win, Con. Currently. His deck is busted! <laughs> kill him! The one that I have out currently would kill you before this matters. It would just redundant. I, I Jason, I'll mill you too. Okay. We got Solitude and Teferi's Protection. Wow! I'll draw a card. Pass turn. Draw for turn. Commander Sphere. Uh, the other one. Oh, wow. Sutra Priest. Yeah. You all lose a life. I gain a life. Study. Hey, the one. Mystic Mo- Disciple of the Vault. And he's like five. Let's turn five in a month, yeah. He's all lose a life and I'll gain a life. Disciple oh, of the oh, Vault! Oh, 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 let's uh, Sne- you pay for that one? No, I did not. But Montu says You paid for the other one, right? I did. So you lose a life. I gain a life. Then I will have a response to that. Activate top. Cool, like that. Uh, sacrifice my two clues and draw two cards. I'm gonna pass. Okay. I'm Response gonna stuff. have a all draw a card. Yay! Ooh. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. What? Resolve. I gain a life. Land for turn. Mm-hmm. You're gonna go plus one. Get another duder. Gain another life. So let's go three at you, Jordan. Okay. We're gonna exile this. And then end of turn, mm-hmm. it'll come back. Well, I'll gain me, a two life and draw a card. And pass, yep. And tap, draw. We will float one. Dire Fleet Daredevil. What's it do? When it enters the battlefield, exile target instant or sorcery card from an opponent's graveyard. You may cast that card this turn. You may spin mana as though as mana of any uh, type to cast that. If you go into the graveyard, exile it instead. Or I could path to exile. You, you, you can want. just do that. Yeah. yeah, I could just do that. He would just counter it. Um, at Rustic Study. I will use the one floating to pay for it. Okay. Um, sure, that's fine. Um, then yeah, I will target Path, and I'll go ahead and play Ancient Tomb for turn. And you actually lose a life. I do lose a life. I'll lose two more life. Uh, using one to cast Path to Exile on Ulamog. You need white mana? No, it's mana of any color. I do have the one floating. Uh, Rustic Study? I'll pay for it. Oh, Fierce Guardianship. Alright, that has been exiled. Uh, draw and discard. Discard this land. Go for... Grimzo. Rustic City? Yes. What does he do? Whenever a creature you control deals take combat damage to a player, choose one. You can goad target creature that player controls or exile the top card of that player's library. And until end of turn, you may cast that card and spend <laughs> mana so it were mana of any color to cast it. Yep. All right. That resolves. Imperial Recruiter. Rustic City? I will pay. Total mana available after that? Four. Uh, sure. We will get Siberia. Siberia? We will cast Siberia. When study? you sacrifice a treasure, Carlos will lose a life. Are you paying for study? I don't think I can. I need to get Ragavan through. So no, I don't think I can pay. Let's go to combat. Let's tap all your permanents. Cryptic command. Wah! And I'll bounce Desire the Disciple of the Vault. Jordan, you got anything else? No, I am all tapped out and everything. At the end of your turn, I will cast a Mystic Forge. Uh-oh. That's Mystic study. Combo piece. Nope. Oh, sorry. Before that, yeah, I am no, going no, to no. draw and discard. No, I didn't counter anything. No, no. you did not counter. So, yeah. I would like to use my nonsensical resources for other things. Results? Mm-hmm. Pay one life and exile. Blasted landscape. Correct treasure. Pay will take keep. Study? Nope. You can do a Mystic Forge twice. That's true. Okay. All right. Untap. Draw. Okay. Let's play an Endless Sands. It Sands. exiles target creature I control, and then I can pay four and tap to... Return everything exiled with it previously hmm. back to the battlefield. I think it's time. Okay. Ermacle. The promised end. Cast trigger. Cast trigger. Targets. Carlos. Rhystic study as well. Targeting me. I'm targeting you. So you get my turn before I do? I do. And I will pay. Uh, actually, I'll not pay. I want more resources. All right. I will play Thass's intervention, uh, countering it unless you pay six. Because I'm paying four, but it is reduced by one. I'm going to pay one and exile the top. Let's see if I can go find it. You can exile Horizon Stone. You can cast up an instant speed. Okay, countered. And then I will 
will take your turn. Did you want to brawl? Actually, I do want to this time. Because I want to discard my freaking thing. No! <laughs> <laughs> Am I going to teleport to your school? Um, sure. <laughs> it's stupid. Yeah. All right, let's go shopping. Draw for turn? Cool. Woo, mind over matter, go die. Is it really? No. <laughs> oh. So let's plus Jace, mill one, and enter the infinite. Good call. Ooh. You do draw. Uh, draw. Well, I'm drawing more stuff, man. We're all gonna draw another card. Draw over here. All right, so I'm gonna go two for a solve the equation. Search for an instant or sorcery. And hold priority. We're gonna go three for a rewind on solve the equation. Counter it. And loot, draw. I genuinely feel bad. I do not. <laughs> We're gonna discard Spelljack. Um, we are very quickly going to unsubstantiate Ulamog. <laughs> Ooh, back to its owner's hand. Ooh. Gross. Back over there. I messed up because I meant to curse then Cyclonic Rift. Because mm. then I give you all these pigs. Stupid pigs. I'm bounce all the pigs. One, two, three, four. Go Gilded Lotus, five lands. For a cast Thrandynamo. Gilded Lotus, five lands? Gilded Lotus, five lands untapped. Oh, okay. So Thrandynamo, which I will then force a will. Oh, nice. Making him pay a life. <laughs> yeah, pay a life. Hitching. Body of Knowledge. How do you draw these cards? I one two I three four, and I'm about to loot a fifth time. Good you can untap so target artifact. Loot. That's true. I will be discarding devastation tide. <laughs> mm. Wait, devastation tide is great for you. It's too late though. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Non so, permanent. Yeah, all non permanent. Three non land permanents. The rest yeah. of us have a butt. Yeah, stuff. that was yeah. probably wrong. All right, so that's countered. Um, I am going to uh, tap this to untap this and tap it so we each draw a card again. Who wants to block a brawl? I cannot. <laughs> I have three one ones. Are you good trading a one one for a brawl? I think I can manage that. All right, gonna go to combat and attack Elspeth. Okay, block with the three. All right. You can send them to the graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Oh my gosh! You guys are not ever playing again. <laughs> this is bad. I just, oh, I just this is that. awesome. <laughs> okay, now I feel bad. And it's in my command zone. I can just do it again next turn. This oh, is so good. Wow. All right. So things I want to curse of the swine: Sutra Priest, Inspiring Overseer. Monkey, Cook, Daredevil. Oh gosh, you have so much crap. I mean, how many? Severe, definitely. All right, yeah. so one, two, so four, five, six, honestly. Seven, eight. Exiles them. Uh, they're, they're exiled. They're exiled. Oh. All the creatures are exiled. Okay. And we get two, two pigs, yeah. Sure, I'll give you a land drop. I don't care. So then one thing stays. It'll probably be Daredevil. Curse of the Swine, X7. And I do think I'll leave Overseer and hit all of Jordan's creatures. Hit six, that feels really, really, really good. Really and you guys bad. get loads of boars. And I expect lots of vengeful attacks back at Carlos. I can't believe he did all this. <laughs> Ooh. All right, great. I'll pass the turn. That was horrible. That was mean. That was really bad. Draw for turn. Let's play a land. <sighs> play a future that was, sight. That was a lot of work. That was a lot. That was cool, though. I'll know myself, too. Draw a card. We do get to see it. Okay. What? Is it unwind? Ba baby rewind? Yeah. Mall Should I? Whoa! Yes, karma, baby! Oh! What, what do you do? He gets a draw card. No, on. do you guys have some some? No, things? I'm all tapped out. Yep. He still won. Yep. How many cards do we all have? It doesn't matter. He'll, uh, he'll, oh, he'll either Jace or he'll mill yeah. us out. Yep. I got nothing. Wow. I got nothing. Nope. See, I have to draw and discard, right? So mm. I'll only be able to keep four cards in hand. Yeah, but you just draw, discard, keep the counter spells, and then yeah. just go and win with Jace. So the only there other is. thing. So I Nexus can... of Fate. Uh -oh. um, now I can just discard Nexus of Fate. And draw out and draw that way. Yeah. The rest I can draw and actually keep. Good game. <laughs> oh my gosh.
Panda one down. I tried so hard. Oh my gosh! What, how is that even possible, though? Who knows? No, I think you did everything right. I just got really lucky. I wouldn't have done anything different. Well, and with this game, and I could have swined for zero and just gotten it out of your hand. Luck is is better than skill. I'm just lucky, yeah. you know. Yeah. And uh, I cannot def fault you anymore. Ragavan uh, ran the game though. Yeah, I think Ragavan was so much fun. It felt really good. Jaden, you should be proud. It, it like it's really cool. I was so d sad going sitting down. That was awesome. Let's, let's yeah. be honest. The yeah, uh, awesome. everybody in you know watching, this is a good illustration of a lot of things. You kill the model blue player immediately whenever possible. It's Every true. Time. Yeah, thanks everybody for watching. What did oh. you think of the game? Um, you know, I'll be honest, I was I was I was having a hard time as a human being right there at the end. Um, <laughs> you know, I was I was I think I was fine, but this uh, definitely changed my attitude, you know. So. <laughs> Which a big shout out to our samurai patrons. Chris Crowley, Worthy Glover, Chandler Carlisle, Jason Garner, John McManus, Jordan Ritchie, Morton Christensen, and Revolution Gaming. You are all the pillars of kingdoms. Thanks so much for watching and keep it nerdy. <laughs>